been doing this for uh, since the early 70s, I guess. We go out and uh, get permission on old sites to look for artifacts and bottles. Well, we hope to find bottles. <laughs> you, dig, you dig a lot of empty holes, but, you know, occasionally you dig a good one. You get a few bottles, a few artifacts, and uh, that's what makes it worthwhile. You can tell by the uh, debris on the end of the probe. You can actually tell if it's glass. I mean, you can tell by the sound. This area, what we call the American section, uh, produces a lot better quality stuff that we're interested in yeah, than the French side. The French side, they use a lot of French bottles, wine bottles, which are just, you know, they're not any, of any value to us because they all look alike. <laughs> the, the fun part about it is when you do find something, the last person to touch it has been dead 100 years, you know. Just a little amber medicine bottle after the turn of the century. English or Dutch? It's, a, it's an expensive, it was a fairly expensive piece because it was real well painted. They painted the, and glazed the top edge. It was a fairly large bowl, probably 12 or 13 inch diameter at the top. Can't tell how deep. They painted the interior too. You see that little pattern on the interior. You start digging into these things. You're actually uh, looking into a window in the past. 